I sparked a revolution I'm not even part of. <laughs> A prom problem has boiled over in Clinton. This because a student could be barred from wearing a dress to the dance. It's something his peers say the school should not be able to do. Channel 3 New London Bureau Chief Kevin Hogan has the story. A male student emailed the principal recently asking if he could wear a dress to the prom. The school superintendent tonight tells Eyewitness News that a meeting was held between the student and a faculty. Senior Cameron Engel thought it would be a goof to go to the Morgan Senior Prom next month in a long sleeve pink prom gown in the style of the character Pinky in the My Little Pony cartoon. But school administrators had to ask Cameron one question. Why? When, when they asked me, it was more of a just, yeah, I was doing it for the fun of it. While the school superintendent says the request remains under review, the question of whether Cameron can or can't wear a dress to prom has taken on a life of its own in an online petition drive. It's not only to support Cameron wearing a dress, but also the bigger issue behind it. Which is? Um, transgenders. And now everyone else is like taking it big serious. Freedom of rights of whatever. And then, and then there's this whole petition thing going on. I'm like, okay, sure. I sparked a revolution I'm not even part of. <laughs> <laughs> Wanting to be different at your prom, even wearing pink, is not new. At Collins Tuck Shop in Saber, owner Ruth says that they try to meet all their customers' requests, male or female. You know, we've had girls come in and wear dresses to prom, I mean, uh, tuxedos to prom, and never had a problem with, uh, with that. Oh, I think if you want to wear a dress to your prom, you should be allowed to. It's your choice. Cameron's choice now is not to go to his senior prom. I'm staying at home. Most of my friends pretty much said, you know, that's screw the prom at this point. We're going over your house. We're going to record a bunch of video game commentary stuff, and I'll be wearing a dress. <laughs> With the Mobile Newsroom in Clinton, Kevin Hogan, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.